Right now at Appalachian Wireless, you can get the Samsung Galaxy S7 for just $99.99 and get a second one free. Service agreement is required on both devices. Serving you for the last 25 years with better service and bigger savings at today's Appalachian Wireless. While many people are enjoying the unseasonably warm temperatures we've been experiencing across the region, the warm, dry weather is creating dangerous fuel for forest fires. Across our region, more than 100 firefighters with the Division of Forestry are in the woods battling fires in dangerous areas. The current challenges right now for our firefighters on the ground is terrain and weather conditions. With the terrain, they've got to look out for steep slope, rocky ground, mine breaks. In Pike County, crews have spent the last two days battling a fire in the area around Shelby Valley High School that has the potential to claim as many as 1,000 acres. And we're pushing 700 plus acres. Um, by the time it's all said and done, there is some unburned areas inside their control lines. So by the time it's all said and done, that acreage will grow some. The crews on the ground mainly use hand tools such as rakes, shovels, and blowers to create fire breaks ahead of the fire with the hope of stopping its progression. But officials say the one thing they really need is rain, and the forecast doesn't look good. We've got a weather system coming in this Thursday that we're hoping to get a little bit of rain out of, but it probably will not be enough. Um, I think they've got a 50% chance of rain with a quarter inch or so of rain but we really could use about an inch or more to really put a slowdown on it to where we could get a good handle on it. Widowich says today alone there were more than 10 new wildfires reported in eastern Kentucky, and the majority of them will be blamed on arson. If you know of anyone purposely starting a wildfire, you are encouraged to report it by calling 1-800-27-ARSON. Reporting in Robinson Creek for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.